Hi, today we are going to learn adjacency list representation through which we can represent a graph. So it consists of list of vertices are represented either by linked list or array. For each vertex, adjacent vertices are represented in the form of linked list. So these are the vertices. If we find the adjacent list, the V0, V1, V2, V3, V4, the V0 has a V1, V2, V3, V4 adjacent list, V1 has V0, V3, and so on. The linked list adjacency list, we have created a struct node, integer, data item is vertex, and pointer next is pointing to next adjacent list. So, first we have created array of pointers. Jitte bhi vertices hain. For that, we have created array of pointers. So V0 to V4 and its size is uh, starting head size is that is total number of nodes. So V0 will be connected. So it is connected to a link list which has a vertex and next pointer. So vertex of V0 is connected to V1. And its next pointer is connected to V2. And its next is connected to V3. And next connected to V4. So V0 vertex has adjacent vertices V1, V2, V3 and V4. So there is not any other vertices for V0 adjacent vertices. So the last is null. Similarly V1 has V0 and V3. Similarly, we can create for V2, V3 and V4. So this is adjacency linked list representation, where adjacency nodes we have represented in the form of linked list. And this is array pointer from where we can start of what is this adjacency linked list. And it's a uh, Link list representation is vertex and node next pointer. For an undirected graph, this is undirected graph. If n vertices are there and e edges are there, the total number of nodes will be total number of nodes will be equal to n plus 2e. For example, if you will kind count total this side linked list, we would have 16 and plus 5. Why we use adjacency list or adjacency matrix? Adjacency list is more memory efficient. Efficient in compared to adjacency matrix. So this is a representation of graph. Thank you.